Tonight, we take you to a Boise rehearsal space that aims to help musicians struggling with more than just their next hit song. The Hive Boise is a sober rehearsal space with an in-house access to counseling. Six on your side's Madeline White joins us live in studio with more on how the Hive is helping some Valley musicians feel safe while they practice. Yeah, and despite having gone through some really tough times, one Boise woman says having a safe and sober place like this to practice her music in has not only helped her to live again, but to thrive. Walk past the Hive on any given day, and by the look and sound of it, you might assume it's a bar of some sort. But step inside and you'll see the only thing they're serving up is raw, face-melting talent. Hive Boise is a sober musician's resource. And for many artists like Sarah, pouring out, soul in its pouring out their soul through music is in itself a coping mechanism. For a person who's got this voice in my head that says you're not good enough, you can't do this, you know, and it's constantly beating me down. It's, uh, I'm gonna get emotional. <laughs> it's, uh, it's just, it's pushed me to the next level. 10 years ago, Sarah was in a bad car accident on Eagle Road. And the emergency room doctor told me, what do you want for pain? I will prescribe you anything. I became addicted to, to pain medicines and that went on for about seven years. You keep, you keep, you keep those vibes. Sarah, who is now the lead singer of her band called Sister Sarah and the Pocket of Bones, says she had just gotten clean from her addiction to opiates when she first came to the Hive three years ago. I wanted to stay sober. I didn't want to be in an environment like bars and, and clubs and hang around with people who were abusing pain medicines because it's a whole uh, community, you know. Now, by finding her safe space to write and practice here, she says she booked a gig at the acclaimed Sapphire Room this month. These are things that, that are successes that I had never experienced before in music. When you're stuck in addictions, you don't grow as a person. And that's what this place has done for me. It's pushed me to grow as a person. And Don, for prices as low as $6 per hour, anyone can rent a studio to play, record, or practice in. So, Madeline, do they have classes as well? They do. They'll teach you how to professionally mix or master your music, band management, bookkeeping, and even about making the best use of your rehearsal time. Sarah says the Hive is looking for more volunteers, so if you would like to learn more on how you can help, visit boisehive.org. All right, thanks, Madeline. Thank you.